Hello everyone, how are you doing? Today we are going to discuss a question which is CAT previous year question of course and uh, that question is based on basic uh, algebraic identity which is a plus b whole square. Let's see. In this question it says that find n if 2 to the power 100 minus 2 to the power 192 into 31 plus 2 to the power n is a perfect square. Now there could be many possible values for which this will be a perfect square but we need to make from options ok. Now you can see all the terms are kind of form of 2 to the power a. So first we are trying to understand here is if I take perfect square of 2 to the power a to the power 2 b, b square this will give us 2 to the power 2 a plus 2 to the power 2 b plus 2 to the power a plus b plus 1. 2 into 2 to the power a into 2 to the power b which will become 2 to the power a plus b plus 1. So, all the terms are in the form of 2 to the power x. This is what we need to do here. We need to convert all these terms into this form so that we can make it a perfect square. So, this term is already in the form of 2 to the power n. This term is already in the form of 2 to the power n. We need to make this term as 2 to the power n. Now, you can see this term is 31 if this term would have been 32, 32 is 2 to the power 5, we can make this as 2 to the power x form. So, what we are going to do here, we are going to do a little modification here and we are going to write this. So, if I write it like this, this is going to help us making this as 2 to the power a plus 2 to the power b form. So, this will be 2 to the power 192 into 31 plus 1. This we can say plus 1, 32. So, 32 is 2 to the power 5. 5 plus 192 is 2 to the power 197 plus 2 to the power n minus 2 plus 2 to the power 192. Okay. This is here. Now, we can rearrange this as 2 to the power 200 plus 2 to the power 192 and this will become 2 to the power n minus 2 to the power 197. Now, this is nothing but 2 to the power 100 whole square plus this is nothing but 2 to the power 96 whole square. Now, if, if there is a term here which is 2 into 2 to the power 100 into 2 to the power 96, 2 into 2 to the power 100 into 2 to the power 96, this will be 2 to the power 197. Then this will become a perfect square, right? This will become a perfect square. So, this is what we need to do here. So, we can equate this term like 2 to the power n minus 2 to the power 197 should be equal to 2 to the power 197 or 2 to the power n is equal to 2 into 2 to the power 197 which is equal to 2 to the power 198. So, if I put here 2 to the power 198, okay, so this will become 2 to the power 100 plus 2 to the power 96 whole square, okay, as you can see. So, this is 2 to the power 190. 7 not 198. So, what we can say about 2 to the power n is 2 to the power 198. That means, n is equal to 198. We can write it n is equal to 198 to make this expression a perfect square. Hence, c is the correct answer. I hope you understand this. If you have any doubt, you can put it in the comments. I will be back with similar interesting problems in future. Thank you. Bye-bye.